Jack, it's been a little while. You must be pretty thrilled to get out there this weekend. Yeah, wrapped. Um, been a while, like you said, and uh, I got to have a little, um, you know, taste of some footy again uh, with the VFL last weekend. Um, and now looking to ramp it up um, and get back inside. Just how hard has it been to be on the sidelines for such a long period of time? Yeah, it's been difficult, no doubt. Um, you know, I probably would have liked at the start of the whole process say, you know, give me four or five months and you'll be back. And uh, that would have been a little bit better on my mentality. But, um, you know, when you kind of try and get up, um, you know, you feel like you're good to run. Um, and then you, you kind of get there and, and then you get knocked back. Um, build yourself back up again, go to play, go to train, get knocked back again. Um, when that kind of repeats for a while, it does take its toll on you mentally. Um, so I'm just really f um, thankful that my body is in a healthy position right now. Um, and I'm, yeah, in the team to, to have a crack on the weekend. Are yeah. there nerves heading into this weekend, given that you did have those setbacks? Uh, I'm not too nervous. Um, you know, I wasn't too nervous heading into the VFL game. Uh, it felt felt pretty normal. Um, I, I reckon once I, we go through the final kind of team meeting um, where we touch on Carlton and, and go through some structural stuff, I reckon the butterflies will come back um, and then it'll be a bit of a restless night's sleep um, coming into Sunday. But at the moment, I'm pretty pretty calm. Now, how is it all, Flynn? You've got, you've got the confidence back in your body now? Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, that was probably something I wanted to to do from the, from the outset and so the, the sports science guys is just be really um, with slow with this one, make sure we get it right. Um, you know, I probably could have played a couple of weeks ago. Um, there were opportunities where we could have pushed it, but it's just been a really slow process, um, which, which I'm you know, very thankful uh, we've stuck to. Um, and, and I can tell you that I'm feeling um, great. You know, I pulled up 100% fine, didn't even feel my foot from the VFL game. So um, yeah, the body's in, in really good health. You admitted over the off-season you probably rushed back a little bit too quickly late last year. What did you learn out of that for the future and obviously with this injury? Yeah, I think for me the learning out of it was, um, you know, the pre-season. Although you try and get fit, um, I don't think it's a time to kind of push your body um, just because there's no time to make it or get better during the season. So whilst you still want to train hard, um, I probably did go into the, the season sore um, and then there's just no time to make it up and then I felt the effects of it kind of come around 15, 16 where I hurt my body. Uh, in terms of the actual coming back from my plantar fascia, um, in an ideal world I would have loved to have had an extra couple of weeks to just really get it right but um, like Goody touched on before, at, at the time with all the information we had on, on the table, um, you know, I felt like I made the right decision to try and come back and play. Um, so yeah, looking back, I wouldn't, wouldn't, wouldn't regret, uh, I don't regret anything, but my learning coming from it was, was make sure you're feeling good coming in the season. Is it stingy you weren't there those last couple of rounds late last year with obviously what happened? Yeah, absolutely, yeah. It was a very important time for this footy club on the kind of verge of finals football. Um, we just had to win and we'll kind of through and to have that not eventuate, um, certainly uh, burned pretty hard and, and kind of still does um, not sit too well with me. So yeah, that was a tough, tough few weeks and, and a month um, after the, to sit back. Do you think that's driving you a little bit now that you're back inside and you're coming in when the team's going quite, quite well? Yeah, I think so, definitely. You know, when you kind of, every goal hurts at the moment. Um, you know, when you lose, when you miss out on finals by, I think it was 10 points or a couple of goals or something like that, it's quite easy to reflect on the season and look at all the little things you could have done and changed and done better. Um, so I've certainly got that uh, mindset at the moment where every goal is hurting uh, and every goal was celebrated um, because come the end of the year, you know how much it can really matter.